Well, baby, baby, look at you. Another one of the old song by BB King, yeah. Well, well, baby, baby, look at you. Hello everyone, this is John Primer. Uh, my stage name is John Primer, but people don't really know my biological name. My name is Alfonso Primer. Um, how I got the name of John Primer was a nickname for my grandmother. My father passed away when I was an accident. Didn't, you know, when I was about three years old. So everybody just called me John's boy. So I was just the reason why I, I said John, I wanted to name my band name, you know, stage name John, after my dad, in memory of him. Yeah, and so now, and I'm a blues man, and uh, I'm about the blues. I come here to play blues for, in Harlem, yeah. Cause I won't let you tell me what to do. You gotta have a feeling to play real blues, you know. Um, you gotta live it. If you haven't lived the blues, then you gotta find the feeling. You gotta work your way to the feeling. But like me, I was grew up with with that kind of feeling and the blues feeling, and you know, was, uh, sad feeling all my life. Grew up without a father, and my mom was gone all the time, you know, making a living. But she didn't run off, but she stayed away for like weeks and weeks at a time, then come back home, go, you know. My grandmother, my grandmother, my aunties, and my uncle. My uncle, my, my oldest brother was my father's figures. He, 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 you know, he, they, the whole family. He was the dad of the whole family. My grandmother and all of them, you know, he was the oldest son. So we all looked up to him as a dad. I don't try to hide nothing. I don't try to keep it from the musician, you know. If I see someone looking, trying to see what I'm doing, I put the guitar right towards them, close to them, so they can figure out what I'm doing. So I try, that's me, that's me, keeping it all alive. All music, now, not just on the blues, but all music. But like I said, I'm strict of the blues, man. It's all, like I said, blues is all about feeling. It make you feel good. It can make you feel sad. If you're sick, it make, make it heals you. You, If you're sick when you come there feeling bad, you come there and you listen to blues, you forget about your pains and aches and things. Yeah, you forget it. So, blues, like John, John Lee Hooker says, is a healer. And I, I agree with him. And he old enough to know that. <laughs> he was old enough to know that healer, yeah. I've been waiting for you to come home. Took a long time for that old telephone to land. Same old blues, same old blues. My 
my original stuff, I, I plays it, but to me, in my mind, is to keep the stuff that were created for us to keep it, continue to go on the blues. And in my mind, that's what tells me to do, just keep it going, you know, and keep it uh, traditional, and, and to keep it alive. That's, that's, that's what I try to do at my best, you know. So, uh, and uh, I don't see nothing wrong with doing it like that, yeah, and, uh, and making people feel happy. That's what, I, that's what it's about. Well, I don't mind. A lot of peace, you got a whole lot of time. Same old story, tell me where you been. Same old blues, same old blues, blues. Gonna find me a mountain, gonna hang way out. Ain't gonna talk to you, and I ain't gonna come out. Same old story, tell me where does it go? The main thing is just um, keep your ego up. Don't don't let your ego get you down on blues. Uh, make sure you uh, if you're gonna play blues, keep it play blues. Uh, it don't blues don't consist, consist on no uh, wow wow fellas and machine big fellas on the floor. It don't, you can use that to get a sound, but it don't consist on that. So I, I, I wish the uh, generation these days just stay straight with straight guitar and amplifier and, and focus on real blues. All the other stuff has come later. Uh, they can play it, but focus on blues. And that's, that's my hope. And I hope that the young generation would continue to keep it blues going. When we get too old to play, uh, we going up in blues heaven. Uh, all the new generation to just keep their blues going. Yeah, because, hey, that's the music, and it's a living. Living, you make a living off it. Uh, another 10 or 15, 20 years, they, well, there won't be no uh, hardly no jobs, you know, and like now, hardly no job for people to work. Um, but a lot of musicians, I see a lot of musicians that working now, you know, they don't have a job, but they're playing music. So study that music, keep it going. And you can all we always have a job, <laughs> so so uh, just just keep it real, keep it real, and don't try to change it. You can't change it. Just remember that. But you can play it any kind of way you want to. That's good if you can make a living off it, rockability or whatever. But don't play this type of music and call it blues. Don't call it blues when when you when you you know it's not blues. And when you hear it, to me, a lot of it sound like rock sound when it play with the foot pedal and all that, the guitar whining, and they can do a lot of techniques with it. It's not consistent on playing fast blues. You play too many notes. It don't take that many notes for blues. It's a couple of simple notes like BB King, Alvin King. They had they had a one lick. Everybody focus on that pew, like <laughs> like BB King. If they wanted to know when that came, everybody try to do that. But just focus on blues. Yeah. Uh, don't try to make blues what it is, but it's not. Because there's only one thing you can do with it: is play it and keep it real. That will never do. Oh, baby. That will never do. Well, it's bad, we ain't got no money, man. All bad luck come to you. Yeah! That's one of them songs by B.B. King, y'all. <laughs>